Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got this uh, quadrilateral ABCD that has been divided into four uh, triangles, as you can see in this uh, diagram, such that uh, in this uh, triangle uh, AED, this angle is uh, 80 degrees. In this uh, triangle uh, CED, this angle is uh, X. In this uh, triangle uh, ABE, this angle is uh, 35 degrees, whereas uh, in this uh, triangle uh, BCE, this angle has been given uh, as uh, 65 degrees. And moreover, uh, this angle uh, outside uh, is uh, 105 degrees. And now our task is uh, to find the value of this uh, angle uh, X. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. Before we proceed any further, let me go over the basic uh, concept that we are covering uh, in solving this given uh, problem. Now let's recall the exterior angle uh, theorem. The exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of two opposite uh, interior angles, as you can see in this uh, diagram. And here, this uh, angle C is our exterior angle, whereas these angles A and B are uh, opposite uh, interior angles, such that uh, this angle C equal to A plus uh, B. And here's our example. If uh, these uh, two angles uh, are our opposite uh, interior angles, then this uh, angle is going to be our exterior angle, and that is going to be equal to 50 plus 60 is going to make uh, 110 degrees. And now let's go over the straight uh, angle property. In other words, uh, this whole uh, straight uh, angle uh, is equal to 180 degrees. Let's assume that this is our angle uh, alpha and this angle uh, is uh, beta. Then the sum of these uh, two angles, alpha and beta, must be equal to 180 degrees. And here's an example. If this uh, angle is uh, 110 degrees, uh, then uh, this uh, remaining angle uh, is going to be 70 degrees, such that if we add these uh, two angles, that must be equal to 180 degrees. And now let's talk about uh, the triangle uh, sum theorem. According to this theorem, the sum of three interior angles uh, in a triangle is always uh, equal to 180 degrees. In other words, uh, the sum of all uh, these uh, three interior angles uh, must be equal to 180 degrees. And here's an example. If this angle is 50 degrees uh, and this angle is uh, 75 degrees, then uh, this uh, remaining angle uh, must be equal to 55 degrees, such that if we add all these three angles, that must be equal to 180 degrees. And finally, let's talk about uh, the isosceles uh, triangle. As you can see in this uh, diagram, these uh, two side lengths uh, are uh, congruent. And moreover, uh, their angles uh, opposite to them uh, are going to be congruent uh, as well. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, triangle uh, ABE. And now let's go over uh, the exterior angle theorem once again. The exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of two opposite uh, interior angles. As you can see, this is our exterior angle and our these uh, two opposite uh, interior angles such that uh, C equals to A plus uh, B. And now let's focus on our this given problem. We can see that this 65 degrees is our exterior angle and that must be equal to two opposite uh, interior angles, this 35 degrees and uh, this uh, angle. So this uh, angle must be equal to 30 degrees because 30 degrees plus uh, 35 degrees is going to give us uh, 65 degrees. So therefore our angle BAE turns out to be 30 degrees. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, big uh, triangle uh, DAB. And now let's focus on this uh, angle, the whole uh, angle and that is going to be equal to 80 plus 30 is going to give us uh, 110 degrees. And now let's recall the triangle uh, sum theorem, the sum of three interior angles must be equal to 180 degrees. In other words, the sum of these uh, three angles must be equal to 180 degrees. So therefore, we conclude that this uh, angle 
must be 35 degrees because the sum of uh, these uh, three angles is equal to 180 degrees. And now let's make an observation in this uh, triangle DAB. This angle and this angle, uh, they are uh, congruent. So therefore, we conclude that this is an isosceles uh, triangle. So that means their opposite sides, uh, this side uh, AD is going to be congruent to this uh, side uh, AB as well. And now let's recall the straight angle uh, property. Let's focus on this angle. This whole angle is uh, 180 degrees. We know this angle is 35 degrees and this angle is uh, 105 degrees. Therefore, we conclude that this uh, remaining uh, angle must be equal to 40 degrees. And now let's focus on this uh, triangle uh, ABC. We know that this uh, whole angle is going to be 75 degrees. And now let's recall the triangle sum theorem once again. The sum of three interior angle must be equal to 180 degrees. If this angle is uh, 75 degrees, uh, this angle is uh, 30 degrees, uh, then uh, this angle has got to be 75 uh, degrees uh, as well. And since uh, these uh, two angles uh, are uh, congruent, so therefore we conclude uh, that uh, ABC triangle uh, is an isosceles uh, triangle. So their uh, opposite uh, side length, uh, this AB and this uh, side length uh, AC are going to be congruent as well. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, triangle uh, ACD. And we can see that this is an isosceles uh, triangle since uh, this side length uh, AD equal to this side length uh, AC. So therefore, we conclude that they are opposite uh, angles of this angle and uh, this angle uh, must be congruent uh, as well. We know that this angle is uh, 80 degrees and we know that the sum of these uh, three interior angles uh, must be equal to 180 degrees. So therefore we conclude that this uh, angle uh, must be 50 degrees uh, and this uh, whole uh, angle must be equal to 50 degrees uh, as well. And now we can see that this whole angle sum uh, x plus 35 degrees uh, must be equal to 50 degrees. So let me go ahead and write down uh, x plus uh, 35 degrees must be equal to 50 degrees. Let's go ahead and subtract 35 degrees from both sides. This is uh, gone. So therefore our angle x turns out to be 15 degrees. So thus our angle uh, X turns out to be 15 degrees. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.